So you're going to double up on all of the ingredients that I'd say in the beginning of the video because you're going to need two pots to put um, like your one cup of sugar, your one cup of white and brown sugar in one pot and your other cup in the other. And you'll need six eggs because you'll need three eggs in one pot and you'll need three eggs in the other. And so basically, yeah, just double everything. The, the pecans or pecans are there just for an extra crunch. So those are optional and so are the marshmallows and whipped cream. And the amounts that are given in this video are all guesstimated because this is all experimental. We were just coming up with this on the fly. So do this at your own risk. You'll need two pie crusts, one cup of sugar for brown and white sugar, pecans are optional, two salted butter sticks, two to three tablespoons of cinnamon, a sprinkle of nutmeg, two bottles of pure extract vanilla, and a mixer, and marshmallows are optional. So wash your sweet potatoes first, boil them for an hour or more, or until like they look like this. And then you're going to drain your potatoes after they're done boiling. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees. And here's the optional crushing of the pecans or pecans. We decided to put um, one like crunchy like pot for the sweet potato pie and one without like the pecans for the other pie for the two pies that we created. And so here we're putting three eggs in each of the pots. So there's three in each and so this is like one cup of sugar the white sugar in each of the pots and then we're going to add the brown sugar to each of them then you can melt your butter in the microwave for 30 seconds or like 20 to 30 seconds and then put one butter stick in each of the pots so next you're going to have your two bottles of vanilla extract and so we guesstimated a half a cup of vanilla extract since we couldn't find like our half cup measurement cup and so we realized that was like an entire bottle of vanilla extract so for the next um like other pot we just use the entire bottle and then here you sprinkle your nutmeg in each pot and then you <laughs> And then you guesstimate the um, two to three tablespoons of cinnamon for each of your pots. And then you peel the sweet potatoes. Make sure you evenly divide the um, potatoes amongst your two pots. Also make sure to peel the potatoes when they're cooled down because it hurts to peel a hot potato. And so you mix everything together and it's um, corresponding pot after you like peel the potatoes and you put them in their own pots you use the mixer and a smasher if you can and then you put everything inside of your pie crust from like each pot and then you can put like the remaining of the like sweet potatoes from these two pots in like a cake pan and then you smooth out your sweet potato inside of your cake pan and your pie crust, chop up some pecans for an extra crunch, and I hope you enjoy this was the finished product without the marshmallows and whipped cream.